Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see, we are suited and booted, and that's not because we're going anywhere. That's because we are coming back from somewhere. So I'm enjoying the video while we're actually done, but I'm gonna give you a rundown. had to go to the post office because we had to go get her passport so we left to go do that we had an appointment we went you know I should have gone to B2 because I do like the curtains that I have in the living room anyways to light up the space a little bit yeah I should have anyways we went the appointment was for 10 15 it said to come 10 minutes early i was cutting it real close i got there though within like the 10 minutes early i got there at 10 01. we're at the post office doing her passport application my appointment was 10 o'clock it's 10 25 and the lady was just there chilling not paying us no mind but we got to do it now right Mimi? and um when it was time for us to be seen there was somebody before us so they ended up being seen at 10 15 and we ended up being seen at whatever time after 10 15. anyways the process was pretty smooth after that i paid for it and everything the lady said it was taking 12 to 13 weeks and if i wanted to expedite it and i specifically said yes mainly because they have her original birth certificate so well, let's expedite so i can get so i can get it back so i did that and then um we just left the post office her little passport is underway. I had to pay to expedite it. The lady said six to nine weeks because the other way it's taking 13 weeks or whatever. And I'm like, okay, I need it in six to nine weeks. This is ridiculous. We're in Walgreens. I'm not walking back. So I'm waiting for the bus. I already did my exercise for the day. 15 good minutes of walking. So now we're waiting for, but I'm looking for the shower gel that I was supposed to buy yesterday and I ended up getting something else whatever else i got feels good too but i need another one that's like that has vitamin c ceramide retinol renews when i was looking at the ones with vitamin c i was looking at these i gotta read it to see are these showers or this is lotion i need either oh my face is so textured I was gonna buy vitamin C lotion since I already have the shower gel, but I didn't even bother because I scanned it and I found it on Amazon for a dollar cheaper. We, and then we came back. I was passing my doctor's office and I think I recorded a clip in there. So if I did, I'm gonna insert it here so you guys can see. So I was passing my primary care's office and I came in here to reschedule an appointment for my physical and the lady at the front desk ended up convincing me to stay and I'm sitting here getting a physical done and then I remember that a physical includes blood work so now I'm shit out of luck trying to see if I can get a varicella vaccine too that I was supposed to get but when I found out that I was pregnant with her I couldn't get it anymore well we gotta see if I can get it now that I'm breastfeeding and then we're going home and we're inside for the day I was gonna schedule a dental appointment for tomorrow but maybe next week honestly 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 she said, I'm gonna get you in in 20 minutes. I'm like, okay, if she said 20 minutes, all right, fine, I could do 20 minutes. And Mia was already sleeping, so I'm like, you know what, I could take the chance. Look at her little side part, thriving, okay? So I'm like, you know, she's already sleeping, so we'll just do it. Didn't end up working out like that. Let's get her bed together so we can put her down while we're, while we're telling the story. She does sleep on my bed next to me, but I put a blanket on there one of her blankets and just like that we have ended our day of errands the medical assistant ended up convincing me to stay so i'm just like whatever she's like i'll get you in in 20 minutes she did not get me in in 20 minutes because she had to do all types of extra stuff she said we need to go inside in the cool i agree
whenever she gets the laying down sensation, she is over it. She won't do that no more. Her little lips are the absolute cutest. Her godmother bought her Burberry bib. Very fancy. I managed to put her down. This is laundry. We have a few things here that are laundry. This morning I ended up spraying some perfume on myself so I made sure that I put a burp cloth on me when I was going with her. We are going to put this back in the living room. We're trying to put away things as we're, as we're at it. But let me show you guys what I bought at the Dollar Tree. Since I'm still here. I ended up breastfeeding her at the doctor's office, so she's pretty fine right now. She's sleeping, we'll let her sleep. Well, we put everything back. I bought a Mountain Dew, I love Mountain Dew. At this point, clearly, Almond Joy has made a chokehold. So ridiculous. Batteries, double A and triple A gum. That's all I bought. Yeah, also, I really like this little bag for like, taking her hair and taking her there. Also, it's very small, so it's not like I can pack it or anything. So I think I'm gonna buy another one for when I have to do anything really quickly with her. Anything more than that, I'll just throw everything inside of my tote that I have for her, my other um, tote. But this is so quick and so easy. So I'm gonna buy another one. See right now, this is packed with her stuff. I literally don't have to take anything out because wherever I need to go with her, it's stuff in here to go. Okay, we'll leave it like that. Now I gotta find a place to put all the stuff that I took out of this bag. I really could put her stuff in this little one because I do like this little one too. I bought it quite some time ago at a Marshall's. I don't even know what the brand is.